Look with your eyes. It's Treasure Island. Are you not happy? Are you not excited? We've done it. We've been traveling for that? hundreds of days and we are here. I just want to go home, please. Where is here? Why and how can you want to go home? What is wrong with you? I just want to go back to California. Just, just think of it. Just near think. California. We are oh, nowhere near California. Are you okay? What's that? Have you taken something? Have you eaten something that's weird and affected your head? There is nothing good going on. Like oh my place. God, I feel it's like I've place. done this whole journey with two people that I don't even know. Do you remember how we started? And how far we've come? Not that far. How did we come far?
Yeah, let's just keep them to the side of it. To the yeah. side of it! Ah! At least he's having a good time, I mean. <laughs> at least that's one Maybe he wants to go swimming. Okay, can we forget about it? Let's get back to cleaning this ship. We need to have this ship cleaned by... Nah, man, nah, you need to you smoke something, bro. You gotta chill a little bit, man. I wanna I see some hands moving around here cleaning the ship. I'm gonna, I'll clean everything. They're actually cleaning! <laughs> Stop laughing at us! I'm kinda new here, and I'm. Um, okay. Pause! Alright, <laughs> all of you, you keep looking at me at different times. Not every single person, but a lot of you are, okay? You're in a pirate ship, okay? We are playing a game. We just talked about all of these different things that could be happening. Environment. What does the ship look like? You're what, confused? Yeah. Right? But you could be lost in your own world. Your person is confused. You could be confused about anything. Mm -hmm. It's a pirate ship. Yeah. Like, where is, where, where's the place where they throw people off the ship? Okay. Where is that? Either side. I don't know how many planks they have. Nobody does. <laughs> <laughs> We're creating this. You're part of being the artist. So right now you guys are allowing her to sort of dictate what's happening, mm -hmm. right? But it's not just about voice. So your person doesn't have to talk at all. Mm -hmm. Or you could talk a lot. It's not about talking. Mm -hmm. But there's nothing happening in your mind, mm -hmm. period, outside of you just, I mean, you're sort of, you're playing around. but. Um, explore, explore the ship. Okay, the 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 scene doesn't all have to happen right here. So you, it doesn't all have to be an interaction, huh? It doesn't all have to be an interaction. With no. Anyone. Okay. Absolutely not. Okay. It could be. It could not be. Mm -hmm. Right. Your only objective was that you're confused. Now you have to use your imagination to create. See, so for instance, if this was an audition, she has her wheels turning a little bit more, mm -hmm. right? So it's allowing her to sort of float around and do things where you're stuck because you're not allowing your mind to play. Mm -hmm. Okay? Um, so go inward. Start thinking about what are the things that you're confused about? She's talking. Do you know who she is? Who is she? My sister. Now, you're the one putting an obstacle in front of yourself. Mm -hmm. Because now you're saying you know who she is, but you're confused. Mm -hmm. Okay, yeah. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, so, you're fighting against yourself. Mm -hmm. You're saying, you know, this is my family, this is, you're confused, you don't know. Mm -hmm. Play confused, okay. all right? You're angry, you gotta raise your stakes, raise the level. It has to mean something to you. Like I said, the backstory to you is that the captain said if the ship is not cleaned, then he's killing everybody on the ship. So you're literally about to let all of them die. Mm -hmm. It has to mean more. Um, and that's just something that you're going to have to work on because you're going to get auditions and you're going to have to be able to hit the levels that they're calling for. Otherwise, you're not going to get the work that you're wanting to get. Okay? So you, this is your chance when you practice to be, have the freedom to play in that. Okay? No one's gonna judge you here. And if someone does, it doesn't matter. Who cares? You're on a pirate ship. So that means that you guys didn't at all make the environment real. 
This scenario is not real to you. You're not really on a pirate ship. You have no destination. You don't know what's happening. You're just playing off of her because she's the one that's bringing more energy to the sea. What were you doing? <laughs> I was a mom. <laughs> I was trying to be silly. <sighs> yeah, you you have to raise your stakes. Yeah. Okay. For you, and this is um, this is something that you have you're gonna have to work on just with your acting in general. It's because you're gonna be like. Uh, For you right now, you're gonna have a lot of national commercial opportunities, right? And so, say with the new agency, they don't know really the background in comedy, they're gonna throw you things with improv, sketch, all that. So, they're expecting that you are going to be extroverted and to commit. Mm -hmm. So, if someone says to be silly, then you need to really be silly. Mm -hmm. And really commit to being silly. Yeah. Not 20%. Because otherwise. You can't really tell them. Well, you're never going to look yeah. anything silly. Like, let's say if that was just the thing. So, yeah, you're going to get the auditions, you're going to get the opportunities, but you're not going to book mm -hmm. somebody else who's bringing more energy, who's actually going to be silly, is going to book. But you're going to get the auditions because you're positioned. So you'll have the opportunities, but then you'll just be driving around, sitting in self-tapes. But in order to start booking with big jobs, you have to commit to these. Uh, and this is just simple, like, emotional stuff, right? Mm -hmm. We're talking about, like, once you get your size and you have to break down the scene and do all that. But, so, fully commit. For you, what, what was your thing? Uh, just that, like, kind of drunk and laugh at everything. Okay, so... Once again, um, you just weren't grounded. You know, she, I think she mentioned pot and then you allowed that to like sort of go in with the pot. Um, but did you have any drink in your hand? Did you have a drink in your hand? No, right? So you had no intention, n nothing. Like you had, you just, you came in <laughs> and just floated around and then they sort of moved you about, mm -hmm. you know? You have to have, have something that you're going after. Maybe you were going to try to find beer. There's no more beer on this pirate ship. And that's what you're, you're trying to see who's hiding the beer. You know what I'm saying? Like, it could be anything, but that gives you something to play with. So now when she says you're high, no, give me the, uh, uh, yeah, I'm high and I'm drunk and I need more alcohol. Because we don't want to just say no. Every now and then you may slip up and, and say no. So you sort of want to go with it. But you got to remember your intention and your character is drunk. Mm. Right? And you're looking for alcohol. Yeah. What was yours? So you, so you were happy, but you, you went out of happy a lot of times. Like you went to different emotions. I think the first time that when he came in, you completely went out of happy um, for like a good two minutes. Like, who are you? What are you? Da -da. And then you like, it, yeah. remember, happy, happy, okay? Mm -hmm. And for you, it's not always about talking. Yeah. Do you know what I'm saying? Yeah, so yeah. you're hiding in, because um, all of us, so we're instruments, all of us, okay? Some of us, uh, can anyone sing here? Um, yeah. Anyone else? You're good, so. Anyone else? No, first of all. Okay. You're singing? <laughs> no. <laughs> so, God, the universe, whatever you believe in, gifted them with voices. I'm just, I'm, I don't know if they can sing or not, but we're going to just go with that, okay? We all have different abilities, okay? Um, and so... One of your, so his safety net is to like close himself off, right? His is to do this or do this. Don't try to fix yourselves now. Mine is to talk. Yours is to talk, right? Mm -hmm. um, but remember, an improv is a team. 
right? Yeah. So, and this is the hard thing sometimes with improv, you're only as good as your team. Mm -hmm. Because if you're the one that's just 90% of what's happening, then the audience is gonna wind up just being bored because they're here to see this pirate ship and all these different like flavors. Yeah, I couldn't agree more. Huh? I could not agree more. Okay. But you know when you feel like no, but it's, no say it, say it, say it. <laughs> no, they're, they're all gorgeous, but you know when you feel like I did was quiet for like a minute and nothing happened. So then I was like, ah, I need to But it's not me. just it's not about talking. No, but nothing happened. No situation changed. Or continued. So then yeah, I guess my little lady actually brain is like, yeah, I must stop talking again. Yeah. You know No situation changed. Or continued. Okay. Like nothing continued. Silence is powerful. Gives us the time to think. Don't be afraid of silence. Mm -hmm. Use the time to think. Maybe you could have went and found the plank. Or any of a hundred other items in this this pirate ship, but you couldn't because you had to do something that had to do with talking, and then you're communicating with them and over them, and do you get what I'm saying? So, but I don't want you to shell off from that. It's just we're just being aware of different things yeah, for ourselves, right? Yeah. To work on. Yeah. Um, does that make sense to you guys? So this time, we're going to go again, we're going to switch up roles, and explore, okay? This time, on this one, you don't have to just cheat, you don't have to cheat to the audience here, okay? So if you see something over here that you want to do, then do it. If there's somebody that you want to talk to, talk to them. Okay? I'm not going to tell you the level of your voice. You can have a quiet conversation. You cannot have a conversation. You can have a loud conversation. Okay? But try to think of some of the things that I just told you guys about yourselves. What did I tell you? Uh, the part about loosening up. Or, um, In this scene. So, yeah, you have so, to commit. You have to commit. commit. You have to commit to the... Okay. No, no, you have to commit. That's it. That's as simple as it is. It's the same thing with the yelling. Right? Took you, like, let's say, 10 tries and then turned around to be able to yell. But you could yell. Yeah. Did everyone hear him yell at the end when he was yelling? Mm -hmm. Yeah. yeah. Okay. So he could have just did that because it's not like he doesn't have the ability to yell. Right? So... You have everything that's it's already in you. You have it. You just have to commit to it. Because eventually you're going to have to do it. So if you don't do it, then you're going to look like a bad actor. Then you're going to look silly. You're going to look however you're thinking that people are going to think about you. They're going to think about you if you don't commit. So your only real safety net is to just go for it. That's it. What's your thing? Um, don't be so high with characters and uh, more uh, like I should have held the drink, stuff like that. Before you come into a scene, from now on, have an intention. I want you to really quickly think of something like, I gotta get to the other side of the room for what reason? And pick a reason. And then go do that thing. And then once you do that thing, I want you to think of something else and then commit to it and go do it. And if someone happens to stop you to talk to you, then yeah, you can play along. But remember, you got somewhere to go. Okay. So, you know, mm -hmm. it's, it's like, I mean, if you have to go to work, and you got 10 minutes to get to work, but then you see a really good friend, yeah, you're not gonna probably just ignore them. You may stop and start talking, but it's like, yeah, 
Yep, yeah, you know, I gotta go, right? Keep it moving. Intention. You. More. More emotion of whatever emotion I'm supposed to be feeling. Create my own, like, backstory. Like, a reason why I was sad. My relationships around everyone. Mm -hmm. you know? And calculate, too. So it's not only, um, it's not you having to just create out of the ether, but you need to have that ability. You do need to have that ability, but you can also take it from them. Okay. Why is she so happy? Maybe her happiness is what's making you so sad. But why? Why? Why would you be sad if she's happy? Because it's making me more sad. Why? It's reminding me of why I didn't want to be here. I got like on the, Come on. The she ate the last twink. <laughs> that literally robbed the happiness. And it was a long trip or something like that. And they yeah. lost and she ate the last granola bar Twinkie. So. No, commit to your choice. She, you ate the, she, she ate the last Twinkie. That's it. Cool. Good job. She ate the last Twinkie. Maybe she's your older sister. And now, not only did she eat the last Twinkie, but she's sitting around here parading, talking to everybody, talking over everybody, happy as, <laughs> you know, she's super happy. Then what does that make you feel? What are you? There's some. There's a word for that. What are you towards your sister? Resent. Resent. Resentful. Resentful or jealous, envious. Make sense? Yeah. But you had to. You would have to in real time think of that scenario. Okay. Do you hear what I'm saying? And yeah. it doesn't have to be that scenario. It didn't have to be that at all. It could have been off of him. He's sitting there like, what's going on? Maybe that's your dad. And he has, what, what is it, Alzheimer's disease? Alzheimer's. <laughs> He's losing his mind, <laughs> you know? <Yeah. laughs> um, it could be a number of things. Be there, search for it. Search for what? Well, if I'm confused, why am I confused? Like, if I'm confused about what? Yeah, and Especially I mean with... environment. Environment, I think, yeah. is, is big for you. Yeah. Yeah, because you're, yeah, you're, you're getting stuck in everybody else's thing, mm -hmm. which is good, being a team player. But, yeah, I want you to think of environment. I think that will be good for you. And... Um, a doing. Get your hands out your your pants and your sinks. Do something with your hands. You itching? That itch. You know something. But if your hands are here, then they're going to be stuck here, and you're not going to be able to do anything. Create your environment. Because then maybe we wouldn't have needed to pull him out to say, hey, have everyone clean the deck. Because if you were confused, then all of a sudden, you're walking around, maybe you see a, a, a broom. And you start sweeping. But then you start sweeping, and then all of a sudden, you think that the broom is your wife. And now you're having a dance in the middle of their thing that they're doing. You're confused. But you're just standing here. And it's like, yeah. I mean, you are confused, but... Raise the stakes. Be memorable. Okay? All right. Come right here, right here, right here, right here, right here, right here, right here. Actually, we're going to stick with the pirate. Pirate ship. Everyone, check off, check off, check off. Check off, check, 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 check. You guys are doing good. Okay? We're just gonna raise it up <laughs> to the next level.